So the Atchafalaya River Basin is important, not only locally, but it's important to the world. We're sitting in a million acres of unbroken wetlands here. There's about 850,000 acres of floodplain wetlands. There's about 150,000 acres of coastal delta marsh. The only actively building delta in the Louisiana coast, probably the only actively building one in the Gulf of Mexico. Just to the south of us, we start to get into about 300,000 acres of coastal cypress forest. It is the largest contiguous block of coastal cypress forest left in the United States. The basin is home to hundreds of species of fish and wildlife. We have about 250 species of resident or migratory birds that are using the basin for either part of their life cycle or all of their life cycle. The basin's home to a number of species of conservation concern, one of the most famous, the Louisiana black bear. When the black bear was at its lowest numbers and put on the endangered species list, this basin was the place where the last remaining ones were so that now they've been removed from the endangered species list. The American alligator is another famous species that is kind of the undisputed king of the swamp here. This basin was very important to its reestablishment and removal from the endangered species list. The Atchafalaya Basin is also important for keeping people safe. It is very important for these local communities in serving as sort of a speed bump for hurricanes and having these forests here. These cypress forests have evolved, they're, they're almost undamageable by hurricanes, and so they slow down that hurricane, the damage, and slow down that storm surge and absorb that water to protect these communities around it. The basin is also critically important for flood control for places, big cities like Baton Rouge and New Orleans because this is the principal distributary floodway of the lower Mississippi River Basin. Without this basin taking flood waters out of the Mississippi River, we would be more in danger in Baton Rouge and places south of, of the river overtopping the levees. So it's not only important for conservation and the environment and these ecological things, but it's also important for keeping people safe and important for our economy as well.